guys so I'm back to do the second half of my makeup collection slash declutter video and this one is going to be my bigger palettes and then all of my eyeliners um, eyeshadow bases and um, yeah like color bases and my eyeshadow primers is that what I said so my pencils my primers and my bases and probably mascara too so, yeah, all of my eyeliners, all the other eye products are going to be in this one, basically. God, I can't even talk today. So let's just jump right into this. So the first thing I have is my chocolate palette here. Keeping that. Just got it not that long ago. My Lorac Pro palette. I'm keeping that. I have Naked 1, Naked 2, and Naked 3. And I'm sorry, but I'm keeping those. Naked 1 is getting older, but... I still use it. I sanitize it sometimes and I don't care. I spent like $80 on that palette. I will use it till it's all gone. Um, this is my Urban Decay Skull Palette. I got this on Hot Look for like $13. Um, I don't really wear any of these colors to be honest with you. So I may give that away. That's a maybe. Um, this is my e.l.f. 100 palette. This has like any color that I want to go to when I want to get some color. I'm going to actually buy a new one of these because this is a few years old now, but um, it still works pretty good. The pigmentation still good on it. It's not like I wear colors on a day-to-day -day basis. So I'm going to hold on to this and then if I do pick up a new one, I'll probably just toss this one because as I said, it is getting older. And this is the Starlux 15 color palette. I think that's what it's called. It's just 15. It's a pro palette, 15 eyeshadows, and it has all these colors in it. And I don't need this and the e.l.f. one, so I'm actually going to give this away. And then I just have to make up my mind on this one. So, um, with palettes, unfortunately, there's not really a lot that I am giving away because I use a lot of my palettes. I switch them out. And I'm not sure about this. Because there's like these hair colors, like the blue one and the green one. I don't have those in any other palettes. And sometimes I use the purple. And I hate this Midnight Cowboy color because it's all glitter. Like I never use it. And then oil slick sometimes I use. But I don't know what I want to do with this. So you may see this. I'm still not decided on this one. So you may see this one in a giveaway. You may not. I'm not sure. Okay, guys. So this is everything else I related. So... We're just going to hop in <laughs> and just grab. So as you can see here, there's stuff that's in packages. These are like backups or stuff that I got from like subscription boxes and giveaways and stuff. So um, yeah, we'll just go through them. So I have the Big Bold Curl NYC. I got this in a um, influencer box. It hasn't been opened, so it's still good. Um, I'm saving... Mm. I'm a mascara junkie, so I'm probably saving all these mascaras. This is the uh, Clump Crusher Original. Saving that. I bought that as a backup after I ran out of the Clump Crusher. This is Big Eyes from Maybelline. I've never tried this before. These were on sale at Target for like $3.50, so I picked that up. Same with this one. This is the Falsies. I love the Falsies. I know that I love the Falsies, but this one I actually got in brown black for like days that I don't feel like dramatic lashes so yeah I'm keeping that this is the rocket I'm keeping that because I've never tried it I thought I had another falsies it must be in there um this is a backup of my um Rimmel nude liner love this from the scandalized line this is Urban Decay Primer Potion Samples that I got with the Naked 3 palette. I'm keeping that. This is a Napoleon Parody Mascara. This was sent to me by my friend April like last year. I still haven't gotten into it, but it's still sealed, so it's still good. Mascara doesn't really start counting down until the time that you actually open it, so... This is good. I'm going to save that because I want to try it because she really liked that mascara. This is a Pixie Mascara that I received in my Ipsy bag. This is still sealed, so I will save that because I want to try that as well. And I'm this is really bugging me. Just give me one second. I knew I had it. This is the Clump Crusher. Is this the... That's the regular one. I think the other one that I had was the... Yeah, this one was the Clump Crusher uh, extension. So keeping those, as I said... 
Um, this is a MAC Paint Pot and Beer Study. I'm keeping that. I don't think there's actually going to be much of anything in here that I'm going to be giving away. This is a Maybelline Color Tattoo in Inked in Pink. I'm keeping that. I also have a, pa pa a MAC Paint Pot in Rubenesque, but it's in my purse because sometimes I slap that on, on my way to work. So I'm keeping that. Um, this is a Julep Color. And it's in Dusty Taupe. I think I'm going to give that away. That's a maybe. Just put that in the maybe pile for now. This is a Starlux Eye Base. I'm keeping that. Put that over there. So now we're into kind of like the pencil-y stuff. Oh, this is kind of more like a mascara thing. This is the Essence um, Volumizing Lash Powder. I'm keeping that. These are two... Uh, LA Splash Mascaras. This one is a blue one in Blue Masquerade, I believe. It's called... If it'll focus. I'll look it up. It's Mascara. Yes, I already said that. Oh, it's at the bottom. Duh, Sherry. It's in Perfect Storm. Sorry. And this one is in... Uh, this one's a glittery one. Hypnotic Teal. And sometimes I wear these on my bottom lashes. But, I mean, I can't give away stuff that's open. Because, like, that kind of stuff that's open anyway. Even if I don't use it. Because I wouldn't I wouldn't do that. Because that's kind of gross. Um, I hate the fact that I didn't use a lot of these up, though. But I only paid really cheap for these. So, they're still good for a while yet. But I don't think I'm going to be using these up. <laughs> Um, this is an Urban Decay Primer Potion. I'm keeping that. I think this came with, I don't even remember what that came with. This is, what is this, Smashbox Primer. Keeping that, it's just a size, trial size that I got with a little kit. This is Benefit Stay Don't Stray. I'm actually using that. It's almost empty. This is a Scandalized Pencil. I actually got this from my friend April, but I haven't used it. Um, I don't really use dark colors a lot. So I think I might give this away because it hasn't been used. And plus, you can, I mean, it's been open and swatched, but you can sanitize it. So this is, I don't know, with Halloween coming up, though, I might use that. I'll just put that over here as a... These are maybe pile anyway. It's not a definite giveaway. So <laughs> I'm very indecisive if you can't tell. This is an Anastasia brow gel. I'm going to keep that because if I don't use it, that's actually not going in a giveaway. That's going to Kristen because she wanted to try a brow gel. This is um, the, the, the Urban Decay Perversion Mascara. I'm keeping that. I do have a Smashbox. Yeah, it's right here. A Smashbox Mascara as well. No, sorry, Makeup Forever. A, a Smoky Extravagant. I'm keeping that. That was my birthday gift from Sephora that I got early. And that's that stuff that keeps falling down there. And then, I think I'm pretty much... These are my eyeliner pencils. I don't really have a lot. But I think I'm pretty much keeping them all. I'm just going to move this stuff aside and we'll have a closer look here. Let's see. which I kind of got to try to keep it separated there, but it's not working very well. Let's use these uh, these as a barrier. <laughs> we'll use that as a barrier. Okay. Let's see what we have here. This is a Silver Starlux pencil. Keeping that. This is Urban Decay Zero, which Griffin chewed the bottom of. This is older. Um, but with eyeliner pencils, I find if you sharpen them, it's just like they're brand new anyway. So, as long as it's not causing any eye issues, keeping that. This is a Chella highlight pencil, which I don't use. So, I think I'm actually going to give this away if anybody would actually want it. Because, I mean, like I said, you could sharpen it and it's just like new again. It's like a creamy... creamy highlight. I'll put that in the maybe pile. We'll, we'll decide on that. Okay. 
Okay, and this is a Pacifica eyeliner. It's like a dark brown color. It's infringed. This has only been swatched. I'm going to give that away. This is my Ramel Scandal Eyes in Brown. I'm keeping that. This is an Ofra. I think this is an eyebrow pencil. Yeah, this is an Ofra eyebrow pencil. I don't feel in my brows. This has only been swatched. I got it in Ipsy. I'm going to give that away. What's the color on this? Does it have a color name? It says Universal. I'm just going to swatch it again, guys, because I just got this a few months ago. Um... It looks like that. It's like a darker brown color. But I don't fill in my eyebrows, so I'm going to give that away. So hopefully somebody be interested in that. This is another um, Scandalize. This is a taupe. I'm keeping that. This is a Ramel liner in white. I don't know why. Yeah, I'm keeping that. Okay, so I have a couple of the Urban Decay liners, the mini ones, so I might give one of these away, the 24-hour ones. This one's in 02, I believe. Yeah, that's in 02, and I mean, as you can see, it's been, like, swatched and stuff. Like, I think I got this in an Ipsy bag, too, and I think I might have used it once or twice, but like I said, if you sanitize it and sharpen it up, it's, it's pretty good to go. So I think I'm going to give that away, because I didn't even get through the full-size one yet, so... This is a Smashbox liner, just a black one, and I'm going to keep that. See, and I have another Urban Decay 24 pe hour pencil here, but I think this one's in black velvet. Yeah, that's black velvet. I'm keeping that one. This one is a Scandalize in turquoise, I think, or light blue. I can't remember what color it is. It's turquoise. I'm keeping that. It doesn't matter anyway. I should have known that. And this one is a Lord and Beery liner. And this is in black silk. Let's see if I like this. I, this has only ever been swatched as well. I'm going to give that away. Because I already have black liners that I don't use. So, the rundown on this is... Keeping, giveaway, maybe. So I have to go through my maybe pile again. And well, all of the other things that I showed. These are basically just liners and stuff. So then I'm keeping all my mascaras and my bases and stuff too. So, um, I honestly don't think I'm going to use this color. I just, it doesn't seem like a me color, but I don't know with Halloween coming. Yeah, I'm going to I'm going to give that away. Let somebody else use it if they can. I appreciate that April sent that to me and everything, but I um I don't see myself using it, so might as well just give it to somebody else that will use it. And let's see. I think I'm going to hold on to the Chella pencil because I think I might use that if I put it back in rotation in my collection. And then this julep stuff. Let's have a look at this. It looks like that. I did wear this one day last week. Um, but as you can see, it's barely been touched because I tend to go towards my MAC paint pots more. This color can be built. You can see that there. You can build it up or you can kind of like, you can shear it out a lot too. My hand was already wet from a wipe. Um, it stays pretty good and it makes a nice base. I think I will actually put this in a giveaway as well. So that's going to go in giveaway. So these are some products that I'm going to be including in giveaways. I'm keeping this and I'm keeping, well that's my wipes, but I'm keeping all of this stuff as well. So that is all of my other eye products, including my palettes. I hope you guys enjoyed this. And next, I don't know if I'm going to do, like, face products, lip products, what I'm going to do. But stay tuned for the next video. Talk to you guys all later. Bye, guys.